right, so we have the sliders here unboxed. And I just need to figure out which side is which, and then I'm going to start putting it on there. Okay, so here's the hardware provided, 24 washers and 12 of each size of screws. The long screws go to the body, and the short screws are the ones that drive and hold these onto here like this. So this is contrary to what the instructions tell you, but I'm driving these in first because if you were to mount this underneath here with this already mounted to the truck, um, you would have very limited space to be able to get in here with a wrench and to be able to turn these. You would only be able to turn these like, I mean, an eighth of a turn at a time. It would take forever. And so um, basically I'm putting these in now ahead of time and I'm just going to leave them loose and I've heard that's the easier way to do it so we're going to find out if that's the truth. The other thing I wanted to show you guys is how close together these screw heads are. They are super, super close together to the point where it's going to be really hard to get a wrench in here. Like, almost impossible to get a box end wrench. You're going to have to get an open end wrench on that. Because, I mean, that is, they are super close together. Alright, here we are into the truck and I wanted to show you guys this right here is the, the two screw holes that this will mount to. Since this is the one on the front and since this is a 2017, it will not fit this one back here. It will only mount to this one here and so apparently that's fine. I'll see how I like the rigidity when it is all said and done. So my word of wisdom for all you attempting this, take these out of the screw holes before you line it up. Because if you're like me, you'll wait until you've got it all lined up with a few bolts in it, and then you gotta work these things out of there with the bracket in the way. All right, so here's what the front looks mounted. As you can see, like I was saying, you only get this one screw in here, and this doesn't quite reach. I've heard people saying that this, it leaves a gap here, and it won't let it sit evenly, but I don't seem to be having that problem here. Um, so yeah, so here's to clarify like that's the front of the truck And then you can come down here and see that this one has both bolts in there just like it should be So here's what we're left with before I've tightened anything down. Everything is looking good. I ran out of light, so I did kind of missed the other side, but I wanted to show you guys what this looks like. You open up the door, and I mean, even with that front one, that front bolt missing, this is good and sturdy and it's not going anywhere. I wouldn't trust it to be a rock slider or anything like that, but I mean, it's a if, if it was mounted straight to the frame, I would. Um, these are super heavy duty and good quality. The only thing they're lacking is a mount point to the frame and they could easily be a slider.